Yeah, welcome to today's class, first order differential equation. Okay, so let's uh, solve this problem. The y dx is equal to what? x, y minus y. Find the general solution. So what we do here is that, okay, let's write solution. We have the y over the x equals to x, y minus y. Okay, so let's, we can write this as the y over the x equals to what is common here, common here. It is what y. So let me bring it out. So if I bring y out here, I'll be left with what x minus. If I bring y out here, I'll be left with 1. I'll be left with 1. So y times x to give me xy minus y times 1 will give me what? y. So now, next thing to do is... Is to bring is to bring where there is y to the y and where there is x to where there is. I will bring this, I will make sure that this y leave this part, join this the y here, and this dx leave this place, join where there is x here. So um we can write it as now, for me to do that, I will need to do what? I will need to um, cross multiply first. Yes, let me cross multiply. So this is like over one, right? So the y times one give me what? The y equals to this dx. We multiply this. We have y bracket x minus one the x, right? So as I've said that, I want to bring y to the other side to where there's the y and x to where there's the x. Now, I've successfully brought x to where there's the x, so I want to bring y to where there's the y here. What will I do? I'll divide both sides by what? By y. By y. So this will give me, this will cancel this. I'll be left with the y here yeah, over y equals to bracket x minus 1 the x, right? So, I can further rewrite this as 1 over y the y. Is that true? Yes. 1 times the y will give me the y over y equals to. So this will be. Then, um, yes, I will have x minus 1 dx. So next thing is to take the integral of both sides. I will take the integral of both sides. If I take the integral of both sides, if I integrate 1 over y, it will give me what? Lin y. Why? If you integrate 1 over x, it will give you what? Lin x. If you integrate 1 over z, especially with respect to this z, it will give me what? Lin z. With respect to the x, it will give me lin x. So that's for that. What about this part? Is Let's break this part further. We have... I will use this dx to multiply... To open the bracket, I will have x times dx to give me x dx minus integration of 1 times dx will give me what? D, dx, right? dx. So here I have mean y equals to. So I'm integrating this x with respect to dx. What will I do? I will add 1 to the power of the x. You know, the original power of x here is what? 1. The original power of x here is what? 1. So I will now add 1 to it. You know, in differentiation, you subtract 1. But in integration, you add 1. So when I add 1 to it, I will now divide both sides by everything here, which is what? 1 plus 1. That's for that. Minus. Whenever you are integrating the x, it will surely give you what? x. If you are integrating the y, as far as it is just ordinary the y, to give you what y. If you are integrating the um, the z, it will give you what z. So if you are integrating the x, it will give you what x. And mind you, don't forget to put your what constant whenever you are integrating. Okay. So we can further simplify this as one. Sorry, lin y equals to x. 1 plus 1 will give me 2 over 2 minus x plus c. This is our final answer. See you in my next video. Please consider to subscribe, like, comment, and share. Thank you.